so my mandolin player, he's going electric, and a uh, friend gave him this, and uh, there's the original nut. I just thought it was crap. So I cut him a new bone nut, if I can get it in focus. All right, so um, I got this uh, little, uh, little bird uh, that uh, I cut a new nut for. Um, but, uh, the action's pretty high, so I was just going to shim the neck, and I thought, I'll just do that real quick, and then I was like, hey, people make videos of doing, like, basic guitar repair stuff all the time, <laughs> so, hey, I'm going to make a video about how to shim a neck, because I, uh, I know that 90% of you probably are like, oh yeah, shimming a neck, no biggie, um, but, uh, there's also probably somebody who's never done it before, so, with a bolt-on guitar, or a little mando bird, super easy. The um, shimming the neck, what you're doing is you're adjusting the neck angle. So if the neck is angled down away from the body, that is going to lower the string action. Um, this, if you had a glued on neck, you would need to do what's called a neck reset. You'd be resetting the neck. Um, so I guess you could call shimming the neck kind of like a neck reset for bolt-on instruments. So you see in the neck pocket, what I'm gonna do is add like, okay, so I, I got a little shim, this little piece of plastic, uh, like uh, a bit thicker than a business card. Um, and I'm just going to stick it in the neck pocket here, right at the very bottom so that and lie it flat so that the the neck that will now sit on a slight angle in the neck pocket bringing the headstock back from the body lowering the strings on the frets which i can raise readjust with the saddles uh, here we are with the uh the little mando bird um i'm really happy with how my nut came out. Um. I got a good uh, action the way I like it. Um, and after the neck shimming, you can see now that my uh, saddle height adjustment screws are nice and low. I found before the neck that, you know, your hand hits that and you'd get cut and like, oh. But anyway, I am not a picker. If you know me, you know I'm not a picker. So I hope my mandolin player is going to be real happy.